So, EA dropped the base hero upgrade. Let's open up a bunch of these and see what we get. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast, and reliable ultimate team coins, check out mmoexp.com. Link in the description. Save 5% using code HABER. So this one has no rating maximum. It's completely uncapped. You can get some really good plays in there, actually. So, we've got a list of some of the best plays you can get. You've got the likes of... At the top, you've got Ginola, Di Natale, Hazard, uh, Yaya Torre, Lucio, uh, Ramirez, Yapstam, Hamsik, uh, Abdi Pele, Vola. There's some really, really good cards you can get. I have the Chelsea United game on my other screen as well. We've just conceded. So I'm going to need a good hero here to make me feel a bit better, please, EA. Great. Great. Yep. Great. We'll take Beasley. Cheers, man. Cheers, EA. Thank you very much. That is painful. That is painful. Great. Okay. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Well, let's open some more and hopefully get better than that. All right. We have got Kieran Space Hero Pack now. What is Kieran going to get? As a big player, CM from Spain. Is that... It's not Gooty, is it? Sure. He looked massive. It is Gooty. Brilliant. Okay. So, Beasley and Gooty to start us off. It's not a great start. A couple of cheap... Heroes here. We're looking for some of the higher rated ones because we obviously we haven't seen players like Lucio and whatnot just because all of our heroes have so far been max 87 and max 88. So let's see some of the higher ratings here. If you open this SBC, let me know down below who you guys get in your base hero upgrade packs as well. This is Luke's pack on the Xbox. Let's see who he's about to get. He does not have a walkout. Is that the right back? Yes, it is. Brilliant. This has been a bad start. I can't lie to you. It isn't super expensive. It's an 86 rated squad that didn't form and an 85 rated squad. It's a bit cheaper than I thought it was going to be. I hope that isn't why EA have just made this really difficult to get something good, though. Because if it is, that's going to be painful. They also refreshed the party bag, so I thought we'd open it anyway. Might as well see what we get. We got a Total Rush player. Who is that? Is that the left wing from PSG? I could tell. Yeah. I think the party bag is a massive IQ test. Even if, with how, I mean, I'm going to do it because of how cheap it is. But even with how cheap it is, it's just the same plays over and over again. She's not a terrible looking card, but... Until maybe she fits an Evo, I probably won't use her. All right, we've got Ethan's base hero pack next. Let's see what he's going to get. You know what? We'll do the party bag first, actually. What's the party bag saying? It's a total rush player. Who's that? Arnold? No, CB from Spain. Oh, it's Asperg. Well, I just saw a bad hairline or what looked like a bad hairline. So I thought it was Arnold, but I'm not going to lie. Asperg has got quite a strong hairline. So I don't know what I saw. Base hero pack. Come on, EA. Who have we got? It is a walkout. Striker from Sweden. Broline is not bad at all. I don't know how much Broline is these days, actually. I typed in balling. Broline is going to be about 350k. I will take that. That's not bad because the SBC is about the SBC is about 150k. So 200k profit in terms of opportunity cost. That's not bad at all. We will happily take that. All right. We've got PC packs now. PC party bag, PC hero pack. Ooh, we got Europa League. Road to... Oh, it's not a walkout, is it? Who is that? Oh, Robin Cock. Not ideal. Not ideal. Uh, hopefully, that means the bad looks out of the way and the hero pack is going to cook, though. Fingers crossed. That's what we're looking for. Not not amazing. I don't know if Frankfurt are doing well in the Europa League or not. All right. I know that Marmouche is doing very well. Here we go. Who is that? Is that a female? I think it is. Centre mid from Germany. It's Kiesler. Um, uh, it's, it, stats wise, it's not a terrible card, but. I just don't think there's any hype around this card at all anymore, unfortunately. All right, we have got X-Pack next. Who is that? It could be a CB. Yeah. Oh, that is wonderful. That Unless I'm forgetting someone, that's wonderful. That's the first time this year that I've packed Yapstam for anyone. What is Yapstam going for these days? He is expensive, right? 1.055 million coins million with an m oh that is wonderful i'm so jealous by the way so je i really want him in my team man x united oh i'm so jealous what a pack pool that is that is phenomenal that's probably the best hero i've packed this year full stop unless i'm forgetting someone massive that is unbelievable get in there all right step his party bag and then his base hero pack party bag is looking like a cam from brazil not bad She's uh, definitely a fun card. It's not a it's not a super expensive one, but she's definitely going to be a fun card in game, I think. Um, different as well. I don't see that card packed very often, so it's different. All right, here we go with the base hero item. Who is going to be the base hero, EA? Please. Cook for us, please, EA. 
Cook for us. Cam from the Netherlands. It's not. It's not, is it? Ah, oh, it's pain. It, I, I honestly, yeah, that's pain. Don't count. Right, hero pack on the second account now. Ooh, what have I got to deal with? Ooh, oh, the Bellingham, the Bellingham Eva, of course, of course. All right, here we go. Base hero pack on the second account. Who is that? Who is that? Do you know what? George's, not bad. Or uh, is it pronounced like George? I have no idea. I'll take that though. She's all right. She'll do a job. Anticipate plus 87 rated, 85 pace, 87 defending, 86 physicals. I think she's worth more than the pack. Oh, wow. I didn't realize she was like 300k. I thought she was like 200k or 250. I'll take that. I think that's decent. Honestly, I'm happy with that. That's solid. Mr. Kofi on PC now. He's got his uh, party bag and he's got his uh, hero pack as well. All right, party bag first. It's a total rush item. Who is this going to be? I've not seen a good party bag yet today. Dolph pick. We still yet to see a good party bag. That is, uh, that is, that is still quite poor. That is still quite poor. Uh, 86 rated Dolph Bick in the party bag, but I'm hoping it frees up some good luck for the hero pack. All right, base hero upgrade now for Mr. Mr. Kofi right here. Who is that? Is that Carlos Tevez? Nice. I could tell by the lack of neck. We'll take that. Carlos Tevez is solid. Very, very good player. Expensive. Uh, X United. He did also play for another team in Manchester, but we don't talk about that. We'll take that. That is actually a really, really good pull. Very happy with that. That's one of the better ones today. All right. Now we've got Fishy's base hero pack. He's got a Fulham badge. He's got some Monday Night Football action tomorrow with Fulham Brentford. He's got himself a left back from Norway. He's going to be Jonan Arisa. A, a banging left foot. You know, it's not terrible. It could have been better. It's not awful, though. Um, he'll probably be worth a little bit, given the fact he's Premier League, but he won't be worth loads. So I guess we'll take it. It could have been, could have been a lot worse. All right, we have got Moltown's party bag and hero. Ah, oh, great. Another Berenstein. Another Berenstein. All right, now for his base hero pack. Here we go. Come on. Who is that? Cam. And the cat is all right. The cat is worth a little bit, and he's good in game. To be fair, he's on my bench, and I've got some good players. So to make my bench is quite hard. He's not super expensive, but he's worth a little bit. Uh, four star, four star, like a good centre mid. It's okay, but not insane. Murs might be on the red list if he gets a good hero. Now I'm, I'm, I'm calling it. He's on the red list. Who's he got? It's a walkout. Centre back from England. Okay, it's not great. It's either Carragher or Ledley King. And I think it's Carragher, to be honest. Couldn't tell, but I think it's Carragher. All right, fair enough. Maybe, maybe, maybe he's not on the red list. He's just got so many good pack pulls, like Eto and Tradable and things like that. But okay, that is that is pretty bad, you know? Who is this? Centre back. Hey, Romero's not bad. Romero's solid. Rome Romero is pretty decent. You'll take that. You'll, you'll take that. 89 rated. Has he had the upgrade yet? Or is he going to get the upgrade soon? I don't really know if the upgrades have been dished out yet or not. But that is a nice card. we take that. All right. Next base hero. Last Palmas badge. Who's that? Do you know what? I saw the hair and I thought that was going to be Ginola. I, my heart sank. Because I actually, like, in a good way. But no, it's a bad way now. Because I now, you know, I'm having chest palpitations and it wasn't even Ginola. But I saw the hair and I thought that was Ginola. McManaman's just a bit underwhelming. He's four star, four star, but he just doesn't have the stats, I feel like, or the playstyle pluses and whatnot. Bat of 70k is not great. All right. Gerald's got the party bag now as well. He's got a Chelsea badge, though. He's got three of them. He's got three party bags. So he's starting off with a female road to the knockout. Is that the right back? Yep. Antonia Silva, I believe her name is. Something like that. Not great. Not a great start. She's about 13, 14k. Um, but like I said, it is a very cheap SBC. But it's just really disappointing getting these bad pulls. Very disappointing. All right, anyway. So, that's the first one done. What's the second one saying? Come on, EA. Show us something better, please. Is that Berenstein? Good start. Good start. Two out of two. Back-to-back -back L's. We're looking good. Things are looking good for us right now. Hopefully. Hopefully, it's just because you got a Chelsea badge. And Chelsea are losing today, and that's why. That's a walkout. Left back. Okay, that's a W. DeMarco is a W. We'll take that. That's not bad at all. DeMarco is a good one. I'll take that. And Xerxes in. Xerxes in. Hang about. 
Never mind. Brilliant. Okay, well, we'll just take the uh, DeMarco then. Ryan's party bag. What's he got? Oh, that's a walkout. Who is that? Oh, it's Walty. Val Valty? Leah Valty, something like that? Not great. Not great. <sighs> Again. I mean, the party bags are whatever, really. We don't care too much about the party bag. Premium pace setter pack. 40% of a trailblazer. 40% chance of a trailblazer. 69% chance of an 88 plus. All right. <laughs> don't mind if I do. Trailblazer. Here we go. Who's that? Goal. Goalkeeper. It is Bree Samba. We do get ourselves a double walkout, though. Who is going to be behind him? Endler. Double walkout. Double goalkeeper walkout. Not ideal. Uh, Bree Samba and Endler. I don't mind it too much because I do like to collect cards from like different nationalities and different uh, leagues and stuff. Like if we get a random French tournament, for example, this card's probably not bad for it. You know what I'm saying? So I don't mind it too much. Although I was hoping for something a bit better than that. I can't lie. Um, do you know what? I don't have a lot of storage right now. So I don't have a lot of plays in my storage. So I'm just going to store them both and we'll open up the next one. The next premium pace setup back. Come on, let's get back to back trailblazers. No, we don't. Who we got here? It's going to be a walkout centre-back from France, Renard. I'm just going to skip it. I don't care. Inform Chevalier, brilliant. Yeah, ignore everything I just said about needing a, ow, needing a French goalie for the league gun. Brilliant. Okay, now we've got two. Um, a lot of walkouts there. Bruno for the lunch. That we are opening these midway through the United Chelsea game, so hopefully Bruno cooks for us. Um, but yeah, they weren't ideal. Let's open up the um, ready, set, rush packs as well. Because we've got two of those to open. So why not? First one is not a special card. Who is that? Striker from Poland. It is Robert Lewandowski. Robert Lewandowski. <laughs> eh. I mean, again, fodder is okay. But yeah, I'm starting, I'm, I'm starting to like... I'm at the point now where I'm like, I'm kind of done ripping all these uh, promo packs when they drop. It's just not worth it. We're just not getting anything good. Like, I don't remember the last time I packed anything that I was really excited about, to be honest. Uh, given the fact that it's really hard to pack the promo cards anyway. I mean, Rudiger's okay, but I've already got him untradeable anyway, so it doesn't matter too much. Like, I don't know. I'm not... Ooh, we'll keep you. Um, I'm not sold. I think I'm going to stop opening the, the store packs after this, uh, after this lot of uh, FC points, to be honest. Right. Rank one reward for Tiz. Fingers crossed we can get something good here. EA, we're looking to get some trailblazers. A good icon. I also have the Chelsea Man United game on, on my other screen right now. And we're watching it at the same time. I'm just hoping United can win. And then we get some good rewards. You know what I'm saying? Like that would be the dream. We do have a German cam from the Bundesliga 2. Who is that? Wow, what a team of the week pack that is. That's the dream right there. Grind to get 15 wins, and that's your team of the week pack. That's exactly what we want. So grateful. Next one's not a walkout again. Nice. Let's go. I feel like if I could get 15 wins, I would just save this most weeks because the team of the weeks are just rubbish. Chris Wood. Brilliant. Nice. Shakiri again. Jordan Shakiri for a second time. The dream. Oh my word. EA. We're so grateful. No, not for a third time in a row, surely. Not another Shakiri. Oh, we get a walkout. Striker from Belgium, from the Bundesliga. Appenda? Is he worth anything? It's not bad, I think. If Appenda's worth a little bit, like, we're happy. Appenda's worth 43k. Do you know what? We'll take that. That's actually okay. 40k, tradable, not bad. And no Shakiri as well. No Jordan. I don't even know where Shakiri's playing these days. Where is he playing? He was, uh, he was in the MLS. Now he's at uh, Basel. FC Basel. Fair enough. All right. We get a walkout. I think this is the 82 times 30, but I wasn't really paying attention. I was too busy looking at Shakiri. Oh, Pedro Neto just missed. Oh, thank goodness for that. Okay, Oblak and who? Oblak? Just, just Oblak. Yeah, this is definitely the 82 times 30. Definitely. What save? He's not even got his gloves on. Wow. That is crazy. Oh, that just went past the post from Neto. Oh, my word. I really hope United win this game, man. I really do. I really do. All right. 84 times 10, 85 times 10, and an icon pack. And an 89 double. 84 times 10 first. No trailblazer. Who is that? Who are you? Ugh. Emiliano Martinez. Mm, not great. Not great. All right. Double walkout, though. Who's behind him? 
Gundogan and Emiliano Martinez. It does suck the fun out of it a little bit when you know the walkout is lower rated and you get a low rated walkout. You know what I mean? I mean like the double walkout, sorry. So like if you get an 87 rated card, you know that the double walkout is lower rated. So it, I don't think there's... I mean, Rafael Liao is maybe the only one. All right, 89 double. Who is that? CDM. Okay, Rodri's good because Rodri's the highest rated card in the game. Joint. So it could be anyone behind that. We could get Mbappe behind that. Come on. No, Hergerberg. Every time. Every time. Every... She must be the most common card in these 89 doubles. That's a shame. I got very excited then because, it, you know, that could have been, that could have been Mbappe behind that, but it wasn't. All right, 85 times 10. No Trailblazer. Who do we have here? Oh, Endler. Endler. Great. We're going to need the best icon pack you've ever seen to make up for these really bad rewards. Yeah, you're going to have to give us like an R9 at this rate. Dino, Mia Ham, something like that. We're going to need something to make up for this because this is just, this has been bad. This has been very bad. EA, not even like loads of fodder there either. All right, we're going to need an incredible icon pack. Who do we have? CDM. Okay, all right. Do you know what? Do you know what? We'll take that. We will happily take that. Mikel Essien. Not bad. Or Michael Essien, if you want to say it the English way. That's not bad. About 750k. I will take that, though. As well, it's not me taking it. But, like, uh, holding plus plus. And then box to, bo uh, box to box plus on centre mid. Holding plus plus on CDM. Jockey plus. He's got anticipate. He's got relentless. And he's got a very nice card. I mean, we'll take that. We will take that. That is solid. That, that could have gone better, but... The icon's decent. Definitely, definitely an icon that can start in people's team. 